Hello everyone, welcome back and welcome new viewers to some more Stormworks. We are back working on our SR-71 Blackbird. I'm super excited about this. You guys were, uh, you guys were super excited about it as well. Uh, overwhelmingly, uh, good responses on this. Uh, got a couple changes to make. Uh, we're gonna make a few changes here today and we're gonna start working on a couple more things. I think we're gonna work on landing gear and maybe some fuel and batteries, stuff like that. But yeah, let's not waste any more time. Let's go and grab this and get it back into the workbench and let's start, uh, let's start doing some stuff. All right, first thing I need to fix is, uh, uh, I need to fix this nose section up here. A uh, few of you uh, mentioned that this is not the SR-71. This is actually the YF-12, and you guys are correct. I uh, started looking at the wrong blueprints. I had a ton of tabs open when I was building this, and I just started looking at the wrong images. And yeah, that's where I, uh, I started to make a mistake. So we're just going to kind of fix this up here real quick, and then we're going uh, to move on. So I'm going to keep this shape here because I think this is part of our cone. Uh, but we are going to actually we're gonna grab these pieces here. Oh, and you know what? You know what helps? Mirror mode helps. All right, now let's try that. So we'll get mirror mode off. We'll come in, we'll put our block down and we'll drag that out to about there. Is it gonna, do, it's not gonna do what I wanted it to do. Okay, so we're gonna have to get rid of this, unfortunately, but we'll be able to do that on top. So this comes out to about there, really. And then we can come in with these. Yeah, I think that's how it's gonna have to work because we don't really have any other choices because uh, storm works, there we go. That's good. And then when we start building our cockpit, we'll be fine here. Okay, so the other thing we wanted to do is we wanted to lean these uh, lean these guys in a little bit. So what we're gonna do is look at ourselves some hinges. And I think for this, we'll use the robotic doors. Uh, let's go ahead and let's cut into this a little bit. Oops, not that much, but that's fine. We can do one like right there and then say one right there. Let's go ahead and connect these two up to each other. Perfect. That seems okay. Now we just got to cut. Let's cut that, let's cut that, let's cut that, let's cut that. Cut, paste. We're gonna do the same thing to the other side here. Let's paste that. Go ahead and merge these with that and that. I think that's right. That and that and that. And now we've gotta give ourselves, whoops, we gotta fill this in here real quick. Let's get ourselves a constant number real quick. So we'll go con. Constant number, we'll just stick it right here for the sake of building right now. And we're gonna go to those hinges. And what kind of angle does this look like? Okay, give me just a second here. I'm looking at another image here. It looks like it's halfway in between 45 degrees and 90 degrees. What kind of numbers are we looking at right there? Um, Let's try 0.15 to start off with. Give this a look. You know what, honestly, I think that might be it. That actually, yeah, that might be it guys. I think that was uh pretty easy to do. Okay, so let's grab this. Simple enough. All right, so I wanna work on landing gear. Um, we need to figure out the height of stuff. So let me come in here and let's put a block here. I'm gonna bring this up because I believe that the entire plane is about the same height as these nacelles here. We can come all the way back. Come on, I just wanna, just need one. Okay, you know what, we'll do it like that because that's how it wants to work. All right, so that's about the height of our plane here. I don't know if that's given us a lot to work with here. Let's come forward here. We come all the way to about, I think to about there, honestly. The curve starts to happen, then you get, let's see, sorry guys, I'm looking at I'm looking at blueprints. I'm looking at blueprints right now, trying to figure this out. Okay, so right there is where the curve starts. Then you have a little bit of a bump up. We'll do like that. Whoops, there's a little bit of a bump up that goes into the cockpits. And these cockpits are very, very small. Um, so it's something like that. And then it's literally gonna be like two windows like that. It's not gonna be very big. Maybe one more. I think it comes down one more, maybe like that. And then from here, it actually comes into more of a point, sort of like that. You know, we can come out one. Let's come out from here like that. And that is pretty much our blackbird here. Uh, so we're gonna need to do some shaping underneath. So let me put some blocks down right there. And this is just gonna give us the idea of what kind of room we actually have to work with. I think really it just comes to there and then swoops back. I don't know, hang on. I don't think that's right because we have the same amount of room underneath that we do above. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That means our fuselage can come to there. I don't know if that's right. It almost looks too thick now. Maybe it's because of this piece up here. This actually is a little taller. But once we put a different swoop on this and an angle, it might it might work because I think I think for the bottom here we're gonna have to have something like something like that to the edges. 
and even that's not gonna work yeah so we're gonna have to uh we're gonna have to improvise here we'll go like that we're gonna go like this and go down so this is the area that we have to work with here yeah so we're getting oops not a lot um i think that'll be okay though i think that'll be okay i think that's gonna give us the shape that we actually want yeah and that's where i had originally had one wanted to end up anyway all right so that's fine we'll do that uh let's get rid of this 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 and this actually i might need that to build off of but then we're gonna work off of this shape here and this really does come down and it's like that it's like that and then it comes out with one of these the two by ones i think i really think that's our shape there and we're gonna have to cram some seats in there as well oh my gosh that's gonna be really difficult really difficult okay so let's drag this back this is all good though. We're learning where our landing gear and things like that can go. Can we make just one single line here? Probably to there. All right, well, close enough. We've got two in there. All right, deleted that. That's actually pretty good. I think we've got pretty, pretty amount, blah, a pretty good amount of room in here to, to work with as far as fuel tanks goes. I think we've got a pretty good shape here, wire framed out. All right, so one thing I'm gonna do is areas like this. Let's just wire frame this out a little bit more. Uh, we can grab one of these. I think that's it. And then we go to some regular wedges here. We can wireframe that up. Okay, perfect. And then we'll come up underneath. And this is just all for visuals, so I can uh, understand what we're working with here. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I think, I think, guys, that's actually going to work really well. Okay, so somewhere in here, our landing gear is supposed to go. Oh, you know what? I might have actually made a mistake here, you guys, on the length here because this piece comes back and sticks out. I might, might, might have to uh, cut these engines and move them forward by like one, two, three blocks maybe. We'll see, we'll see what happens. I'm not, I'm not focused on the back end right now. We are going to focus on our landing gear today. Uh, that's what I want to get. So let's look at sideways, somewhere in here between the cockpit, uh, about right in here, we're gonna need some wheels. All right, so we've got our wheels uh how do these wheels look these are actually probably the appropriate size uh for this actually yeah that's not too bad uh but they need to come down a lot lower um so let's do this let's go ahead and see how low we can go with that not far uh how much room can we go up let's go ahead and uh, move up since we know the height there perfect uh and i do believe i do believe this folds backwards so if we could go ahead and plan for this We'll do a couple blocks here. We'll do something like that. Let's go ahead and get our hinge again. And I think we'll use the robotic one this time just for funsies. Okay, that looks pretty good. Uh, we're gonna need to come down. I need another image of this landing gear here. Hang on one second. Okay. So I'm not sure if I should build it open like this or we build it closed and have it. And you know what? Actually, I'm on the wrong side here anyway, you guys. Um, but yeah, let's do this. Let's build it. We're gonna build it up in the, the section here, like so. Uh, we're gonna need a nice little long pole here. Let's go get our wheels. All right, that's gonna look something like that. Let's get that out of the way. Hit that like that. And we've gotta come up with a way to hide this. So I think we have to move this up one more block. Yep, I think that's where we're gonna have to go with it. All right, so we've moved that up one block, perfect. So that means we can actually put a block under here. Nice, so we'll be able to close up this with a couple doors. Uh, speaking of doors, let's figure out the width of those. So this is the hole that this needs to function through. So really all we got to do is find a way to just open and close this. This is going to be a small little, uh, door here. So let's come back here. I think what we can do is we'll put some pivots. Actually, hang on. If this comes down, this is going to fold into, into here. Let's clean this up. Right, so that folds down. This is gonna fold all into the way here. Maybe let's do our pivots on this end. I think this is gonna be the spot to do it, but is this gonna clip with this? This is gonna clip one, no, one, which is this. Actually, that's gonna stay in the same spot. Sorry, I'm trying to figure this out. This one will come into this spot. This one will come into this spot. And is that gonna be enough to clear this? It might not. We might actually have to get rid of those. All right, so let me get the pivots. Let's figure this out. I'm getting distracted by a triangle piece. All right, so we got a compact pivot and I want that to open when the landing gear is also trying to be opened. But yes, perfect. And then I don't know what I just did. I got lost. I think, is this how I want to do this landing gear? I'm not sure. Will those fold out of the way? Those will not fold out of the way. 
Okay, I need to move everything over by one to here. Now, we should be able to get everything out of the way. So that is part of the door. This is going to be, okay, so here's going to return one side off. Or do we do it like, uh, like teeth? I know it's not like teeth on the, uh, the actual thing. So let's not do it like that. Let's do, let's do a two by one on this side and we'll do a regular one by one wedge on that side. And that should give us enough that these will open. These will pivot out of the way, allowing this gear to come down and give us some landing supports. I hope this is not too big. Uh, we're gonna need a throttle. I'm gonna test this out. And I guess I can go ahead and plop a seat down in here, right? Cause we got, uh, we got our glass in here. We'll do it like that. I think that's there is for usually a co-pilot or the little bubble that sits up on top. Uh, let's use our throttle real quick. We're just gonna hook this up to that, that, and that to see if this works. All right, so I'm spawning this in. Looking good. All right, let's get in this seat. Did that cause all this to open? It did, okay. Let's go all the way with it. Okay, so that's open all the way. Does that look too tall? I think it might be like one, one block too tall. But I think we're gonna shorten that. All right, so we're just gonna shorten this. Get rid of that, come on, get rid of that. Perfect, and I think we're good there. Actually, I mean, we can put these back now. We don't have to look at those. And since I know there was no clipping, I'm gonna go ahead and put the start value of this throttle on one. I think that's gonna work. I really think that's gonna work. Uh, I might bring our door fold back by one just so I can add in some detailing with some maybe like uh, some pistons and stuff that go in here. But I, I think that's gonna work for our front landing gear. Uh, let's figure out, uh, let's close this in. Actually, you know what, we'll leave it like that for now and then we can figure out what space we need to work with. I think we're gonna throw a bunch of batteries and microcontrollers into this area and then all back here is gonna be our fuel tanks and stuff. But we need to come back to about here and how, how tall was this? Let's figure this out again. Off of the pivot, it is gonna be one, two, three, four, five. But out of here, how tall is it? Let's try this again. One, two, three, four blocks off the bottom, all right. And these guys are somewhere in this little wing section here. Uh, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna come in and put some blocks down like this. And I'm gonna do it on both sides because we're trying to put wheels on both sides here. All right, so there we go. That'll give us a nice little area to work off of because what it looks like is the wheels for these back guys are literally right behind this little section here and somewhere in here when they fold out. So our pivot needs to be like right here. So right here, our pivot needs to be actually probably over one more, maybe even two more like that. Yeah, I think that's gonna be where it's at. All right, so let's get our pivot. Nope, our hinge. Let's lob that into place. That works, okay. Let's get one, two, three, four. I don't remember how many we need of this. Ooh, these are gonna collide. This might not work. And our back wheels, they need three wheels and we only have a two set. So we're just gonna use a two set because that's what we've got. Um, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I want two more. Okay, this might work. This might work. Oops, oops, let's grab that. These are gonna need to be sideways as well. Oh man, is that really gonna, is that, can I not do that? Uh, okay, you know what? This might be, this might be better. I, I think we're gonna have to have them down by one. Let's see what this looks like. Otherwise, we're gonna move our pistons. I keep calling them pistons, excuse me. Our, um, our hinges might have to go back by one block. Uh, let's hook this up to our throttle here. Is this, where is it? Throttle, how does that look when it, when it opens up? Okay, so we have another issue here. Uh, we've got weight issues. I think this might be solved once we start putting some batteries and stuff up here. Uh, we'll be a little more uh, nose heavy. Um, I'm gonna put some weights in it just for the sake of this. Actually, let's go ahead and throw a couple batteries in it because they will be up here. Batteries. And I'm just gonna stick these on the top here. Whoops. Let's see if that's enough to keep us level here. Ooh, no, it's not. Okay. All right, so that didn't work. That's probably not where I want these. So let's go for some weight blocks. Those always, uh, those always do the trick. I'm gonna make a wall here of weight blocks. Is that gonna be enough to do it? Oh, it's so close. It's so close. Okay, do another little block there. Okay, good. Um, I don't think it has the little bit of lift in the front like this, but I think that's gonna be beneficial for us, especially getting off the ground in Stormworks. And I don't think you notice it too much. I don't think it's that bad, but okay. So those landing gear work. Let's get some, um, we've got to get some doors on these. That is the other thing. How do we do that? And it's moving forward. Stay still. All right. So those work. If I raise these up by one, then we might be able to get the doors that open up. And also this needs to be like this. We got to figure this out. That's like that. This is our belly here. Yeah. We might have to move anyway, because this might not work. 
Okay, that does work. That works, that works, that works. Okay, so we just gotta figure out how to make a door here. Oh, this might actually be a little easier than I thought. Um, okay, come on. Now, I just gotta figure out where we were. Okay, so it's this, it's this block right here. Let's, uh, let's grab our tool here. Try not to lose this spot. Oh, that makes it easier when we can see through it. Okay, we're gonna grab all this, including, you know, we'll change that up here. Uh, we're gonna cut all this, cut, paste. We'll come over here, we're gonna rotate it. Find that spot there, paste it. Okay, so now what I wanna do is merge these with that and with that. And I don't think this is gonna work the way I wanted it because, yeah. Here's what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna change this up. Let's move this, I'm gonna do some wedges here. And I'm not sure if this is gonna work. I think I'm gonna have to put, you know what? Let's go back, I'm gonna try it, let's try it. We'll see. Let's see what it does like that. We'll spawn it in. How bad are those? Oh, they don't like them, they don't like them, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Fair enough, fair enough. Let's do this. Let's move this entire package up. We'll cut that, we'll move this up. Yeah, I know I moved the parts that I didn't need to move. Um, Let's do that, we'll delete that. Then maybe put that like that, maybe? Hopefully that keeps it from uh going haywire. So then maybe we'll put uh the two by ones in here. That should be a nice little transition piece if I can get them across there, okay. Come on, merge that with, with this. No, merge this with this. What, why? Cause that's flashing that with that and that with that. Okay. Maybe this is better. Um, let's make this look a little nicer there. Let's spawn that in. See what that looks like. Okay. hundred percent. That's broken. What did I miss here? What am I not merging? Oh, this needs to merge. No, it doesn't. This needs to be merged with that and separate from that. Okay. Clear. Let's resize this. We're just going to cut everything. Cut paste. All right. You need to merge. Okay. You need to be separate as well. Clear. Cut, paste. Now can I merge? Oh no, I'm gonna need a block in here. Okay, so we'll do that, do that. Now I should be able to merge that with that and that with that. These now get merged to the actual body of the vehicle. Perfect. And here's where I think we're gonna have some problems, right in there. So we're gonna go like that. Or maybe none at all. I think none at all, actually, because these are coming up in as well. Let's try that. How wonky does that go? Those don't even open. Is it because of those? Only one way to find out. Let's delete it. Oh, I've got stuff in here I want to delete too. Let's do that. All right, were you the culprit? No. Why are these not moving now? Are they not connected? They are connected. Okay, so they're getting a signal. Is Why is it stuck? Is it this? Is this getting it stuck? Is this not? That's not part of... Ooh, okay. Can we try again? Yes? Why are they not moving? I'm so confused. They're bugging out. They're trying to move. Is it this block? Oh... I got some extra blocks in here. I think it's these. And then what we'll do is we'll do that there. No, this can be filled in like that. I think so. I'm getting myself confused now. Is this working? Urgh, no, why? Why aren't you? So now you're hitting this. So maybe we're gonna have one spot that looks like that just so the landing legs can open. Please, please open. Why are they not opening? What is going on here? Why can't these open? What is merged to what? It's not those. I don't get it. You know what? Let's do this. I'm just going to get rid of the whole door. I feel like the door is causing problems. And let's figure out why these aren't coming down. Still not coming down. What? I'm so confused by this. Okay, we're going to get rid of everything. Anything that is attached to that. There's no way that's hitting this and not able to come down. If that is the case. Okay, let's test it. I think that might have been what's it. Okay, that's what we got to figure out now. Is it these? No, what is bugging these out? Why won't these go down? Are they like trying to hit each other as they're going down? Uh, you guys, I think that's what's happening. Oh, hang on. I think as they're coming down, they're trying to hit. No, there's no way. Let's get rid of the wheels. Well, those go down. No, why are these so broken? I've literally deleted everything and now we're back to these don't work. All right, I don't know. I really, I really don't know you guys. I'm starting over. I'm starting over. Because, yeah, I, 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 I can't figure it out. Uh, so let's do this. Let's do a couple things there. Let's go ahead and hook it up to our throttle. Spawn it. Does that work? Yeah, those go down. Okay, I don't know what's going on. All right, let's add some wheels. Does that work? Okay, that works. All right, now I just got to figure out how to like close up this, this hole here. Um, I'm just going to do it like this. Hopefully this works. Hopefully this works. We're going to see. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. Can we do like I actually wanted to do? Okay, hang on, hang on. 
We might actually have a thing here. So we can do this. Come on, get under there. We can do that. That looks terrible. Okay, so that's how the landing gear should be. Let's try, please just come out and don't be janky. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. I think we can get rid of all of these blocks in here. Yes. And then we do it like that. Now we can actually make it look good. Let's do this. Oh, I think we've got it. I think we've got it. I think we, okay, where's the, where's it at? Is that still causing problems? What is that hitting? Ah, uh, okay. It doesn't like any of that, apparently. Let's try that. What is it still clipping? Ah, uh, it doesn't give me a chance to look. Why is this so hard? This should not be this hard. How about that? That does it, but why? Why the wheels? Why is that a thing? Is that still pushing the pivot out? Okay. Uh, this is not going to work the way I want it to. So this is all... This comes up. So do we get rid of that and that? And then do something like this? It just feels so unnatural, though. Like, it's not supposed to be like this. I just need it to spawn in without being shaky. Okay. All right. Now that it's like this, what room do we have to work with? None right there. Well, I think that's going to be it. That should work. I mean, we are literally like dragging the ground there, but that does what we needed to do. Okay. Oh, I feel like we can move on a little bit here. Okay. Now that we know the area that this needs to be in. So what we can do here is I think, I don't know. I don't know right now. Um, where is all the fuel stored in this plane? I think most of it's in the middle section here, kind of around the, uh, around the wheels. So let's go ahead and get our tanks. We're going to, we're going to put a bunch of jet fuel in this anyway. So, or do we do a custom tank? We could custom tank this. Maybe that's what we do. Uh, okay. So hang on, we'll come up, we'll come across like this. Let's box these in. So that these are nice and secured and we'll hide these from each other. Like so we'll build the box around that and box around that. Cause honestly, I think all this has to have some new shape to it. Yeah. If we don't need a block there, we're not going to have a block there just like that. I don't think we need those blocks, but we're trying to make that a nice little area to hide those wheels. Okay, so where it looks like all of this is just tank. Uh, all this up front, all this back here. I mean, what else am I going to use this for anyway, other than uh, fuel? Okay, first of all, we got to figure this out. How do we transition? Because I think our wheels have just ruined our shape here a little bit. Uh, what can we take off the top here? Give this thing. Oh, this thing can have a massive haircut. Hang on. Okay, okay, so here. We can get rid of all that and we can get rid of that. That could all be wedged. Okay, so one, two, three. One, two, three, like that. I gotta get our box shape that covers up all of it. Oh, this is so close. This is so close. Oh no. Okay. Hmm. We might have to improvise back here a little bit. We might be going up a little bit, which is fine. So we'll just do like that. Uh we still gotta cover this up. Alright, so I'm gonna fill all this in. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna fill all this in. And we can just run block pipes if we need to. I just want to hide all of that. And then we'll hide all of that. And then how does it work? Oh, it's, it's like the twos from there. This is really difficult, you guys. It's because we're having to accurately do something. That's why. Okay, so the twos. Let's drag this out across. Oh, okay. So somehow I've got to bring all this up by one. I think we're going to do this with inverse blocks. I think we can do this like very subtly. And you won't notice it. Is there another two right there? No, there's not another two. Is that going to allow me to do what I want to do, though? Yeah, I think it is. Okay, so we'll come across there like that. Then we can come across like that. Yes, okay, okay. This is how we do it. This is how we do it. We're going to get a little bit of a hump there, but that's fine. That's fine. We can do like that. Perfect. We'll come in. We'll fill this in like so. Like so. We'll close on all that. Close on that. This needs to be an inverse now that I'm looking at things. Perfect. Then we'll do like that. That closes all that in. And then, see, we got to go another two by one across here like this, which doesn't match up, which is fine, because then we'll come in here and we'll do another one of these. And once we paint all this black, you're not going to really notice this at all. Get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that. That comes across like that. Oh, that's still open to that. We might be revisiting these landing gear. I don't know. Oh, I really want to move them down by one, but that doesn't help us under here either. Although I feel like we can. I feel like we have, I don't know, it's this area here that really confuses us. Once this goes down, it pushes into another little zone. I've got to try this. I mean, if it doesn't work, you guys won't see this. So whatever. Okay, that's down by one. Let's paste that, merge it. All right, spawn that in. How does that look? It doesn't clip. That's probably the height that we need it to be at too, if I'm honest. What does that do for us here visually? We're gonna have to do some changes under here. 
all right does that work Ooh, yes it does yes it does okay i'm gonna fix this other side here and then we'll uh and then we actually we can actually get the top the way we need it to i hate that this is taking so long i hate that this is taking so long but it's gonna mean that we can get rid of all this we can get rid of all this all this can be done right and that's what we want okay so i've just got to make sure i do this on the, the same on the other side here all right i think this is right let's see if this uh okay wheels come down no glitching and yeah when they're uh when they're in they're nice and snug perfect and that gives us the room to build here okay cool let's get this fixed let's get this fixed because this was our major problem here okay so we can close that in close that in that means we can close this in oh i'm so glad i changed it i'm so glad i changed it except that now is our problem mm, it's always a little bit of something okay here's where we might be uh we might be doing some extra little work here uh, how does that work yeah see because we're going to start building our wings out and our wings are going to be kind of thick that means this is going to be blocked in like that okay that's fine i think we're getting there you guys i think we're getting there let's um let's inverse this there we go now we can start to actually figure some of this stuff out they're coming there like that let's go ahead and do this oh it connected let's not do that like that let's do it like that there we go and then we can come in here like that is that too broad because we could do let's do this Ooh, you know what i don't think that's gonna work either because we've got that edge right there you know what let's do this let's, we're gonna do it uh let's get rid of that and we've got the inverse pyramid for this and that's a lot smoother transition into the wings there all right this we can handle we can handle this let's do a uh we'll just do an inverse like that all right that's fine a little weird connection there whatever it is what it is we'll hide it with paint uh cool so let's continue what did we actually get here do we have an actual area that we can work with we do if and i want to fill these in when this comes down pretty sure it locks into here let's do that let's fill all these in and this will give us our actual area for a fuel tank at least one fuel tank i'm sure this thing had multiple fuel tanks and then we got to figure out a way to get some uh, like refueling to it as well uh let's fix this with say some better blocks uh what if we use this big one here we can go like that around the wheels and then we'll just do that Does that work i think that works perfect and that's nice and smooth in there now cool okay let's let's go across here like that let's go across here nope that's not how we're gonna do that we're gonna have to transition into that somehow as well i don't ever plan these out uh so here we'll do a uh pyramid here that's okay and then maybe we'll do a long one here i don't know what we're transitioning into we're transitioning into that piece oh let's do let's do that do that as far across as we can go and i think we're just gonna have to jump out a little bit like that just for a second and then we can come back yeah i think that's what we're gonna have to do it's it's a little ugly but it's gonna work and then we'll just shoot across there like that i don't think you'll ever really see that especially here let's yeah you'll never see that never oh my god this thing is sick okay okay we're jumping the gun i can't paint yet i can't paint yet oh it's so good it's so good okay so we've got a little area here i think this is gonna be a fuel tank for us let's go ahead and let's get some blocks here and we'll fill in that like that and somehow ooh, it comes into here too all oh this is gonna be our, our loop around to be able to make this the fuel tank back here as well okay this is gonna be good this is gonna be good all right so we'll fill all that in we'll drag this back we'll fill that in and this is not gonna be a huge fuel tank back here but it is gonna be a fuel tank if we need it if we even need it i don't even know if we'll need this much fuel it might be too heavy but we'll have space for microcontrollers and things like that all right i'm just gonna get this filled in just right here and we're gonna go to right about there and i am gonna call it there you guys uh it took me way longer to get these uh landing gear done than i expected uh let's go ahead and spawn this in one more time let's take a good look at this yeah but i think they're actually gonna work the way i want them to they're nice and snug stop bouncing stop bouncing yeah it, we, we're just running into weight issues right now uh we need more weight up front and that'll that'll come as we add more blocks we'll put all our microcontrollers and more systems up front uh we'll throw our batteries and things up here we can add more weight blocks up front too uh, but that will uh that will be good let's take a look at it from the front here uh let's jump Ugh. okay you know what let's uh no clip yeah i think this is gonna be a pretty decent build here uh so yeah guys thanks so much i uh, appreciate you 100 uh if you're enjoying this series make sure you throw a like on this video subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and uh yeah uh we've we've got landing gear we started working on our fuel tanks 
Uh, we're going to start working on the cockpit and the rest of the body shape. Uh, we're going to do a test flight and then paint. And then you guys can have this. I'm going to put this on the workshop and then this is, a, this is for you guys. You guys are going to uh, redecorate it, add extra stuff to it, however you want. And then we're going to start on uh, something else after this uh, for you guys as well. Uh, one more time. Let's do this. Look at that. Not perfect. We got to work on the timing with that. Okay, so there's some issues there. We'll get a we'll get a nice little microcontroller set up to get those working. But uh, yep. Other than that, everything works pretty good. So yeah, guys, thanks a lot, and we'll see you in the next one.